Buddy. All right, today's the day. We're in beautiful Montana and we're going to check out Glacier National Park. This is one of the parks that require a reservation and luckily for us, we have one. We actually had two, one that was unusable until we were kicked out of our last park. So now we can actually go early and we can go one more time before we leave. So once again, thank you to the last part who kicked us out and made us come here early. Can't wait to check out Glacier. Let's go check it out together. Go in the Glacier. Y'all ready to go to Glacier? I am. See you in literally three to four minutes. <laughs> gonna make it through here. <laughs> oh yeah, this is the one you said they decided for you. Yep, not today, momentum. <laughs> Darn. My camper can't go through that. No, camper can't go under that bridge. We'll get stuck. Well, we may not be stuck, but we're gonna be missing some parts. My daddy, it wasn't stuck. We got to do one call. Ashlyn, <laughs> where are we? Do you remember? What's the name of this place? What what national park is it? Can you say Glacier? Glacier, Glacier National Park. Alright, normally we would stop and take pictures of that, but we're in a really long line. And I <laughs> doubt they're gonna let us back in when we get done there. What are you doing over there? Checking out the homework. Ashlyn, what's this? A butterfly oh. turning into a caterpillar. A butterfly turning into a caterpillar. Almost so, right. <laughs> so Junior Ranger program, here we come. So that's Lake McDonald, and we're only like a mile away from the visitor center. We haven't even started with Glacier, and it already looks this good. park when it starts out with a waterfall we've only made it like six miles in <laughs> we've done seeing a waterfall and a really beautiful lake both called mcdonald Okay, so that didn't even have a sign. We don't even know what this is called. It's not on the map. It's That's just the regular side of the road attractions around here. I want a Ashlyn, what'd you think about the waterfall? Good. It was just good? And then I would lie down. Which one oh, was yeah? better, the first waterfall or the second one? Second one. Oh, I'm sad I missed it. Yeah, they don't even name these, they're so good. Just just regular, regular side of the road pullouts. Got waterfalls here. It's gonna be a good park. Can you say Glacier National Park? Glacier National Park, too. Well, you heard it from the official tour guide. We're at Glacier National Park. We stopped real quick right before we start going up Logan Pass to have some lunch, enjoying the views. And I heard the road's gonna be real interesting with this dually here in a minute. I guess we'll find out. We've taken it everywhere else. Why not here? Ready 
ready? the big bend pull out here alicia what do you think about this park so far man i didn't think it could get better than yellowstone this is awesome we could stay here for hours this is a pretty amazing park so far and we're not even to the top of the mountain yet Visitor Center there was definitely no parking especially no parking for a big dually but it was still pretty to drive through and see just give away waterfalls right here like they going out of style <laughs> you get a waterfall and you get a waterfall and there's a waterfall <laughs> So what we found is that every parking lot we go to is full, but it doesn't matter. This is literally just the side of the road pull off and look at this view. This is called the Goose Island Overlook and it's pretty amazing. Everything about this park so far has been beautiful. I don't know how we're going to make a video out of this without leaving something out. Anyway, let's go see what's next. So we made it to the Rising Sun. Unfortunately, the whole area was closed down. So we went on down the road to the St. Mary's Visitor Center, which is actually the east entrance into Glacier. So right now, Alicia's inside using the restroom and getting some souvenirs. The girls are smooth wore out. We're gonna take a little break here, get us a snack, and then we're gonna head back over Logan Pass to the other side of Glacier. Just left the visitor center and we saw a bear. But by the time we got our truck parked to look at it, it already, it already went and hit again. Ashlyn, what did you see the bear? Yeah. Where'd it go? It went in the woods. It said, I'm done taking pictures today, didn't it? <laughs> You're not happy about missing the bear, are you? Hello. Hi. How'd you like this lake? You want to live here? Yeah. All 
right, traffic has stopped on the highway. And what that usually means is there's an animal really close to the road and everyone's stopping to take pictures. Hopefully it's a bear. We haven't seen a bear yet. Oh, this guy right here is so excited, he's backing up. He put it in reverse. Oh my gosh, look at the bear. We found the bear. Okay, look over there. It's eating the berries. Oh, how cool. It's a grizzly bear, Ashlyn. What is it? It's, a bear. it's right behind you. It's right bear. Behind you. In the bushes. You see him? He's face back. If you got out of the you. car, he would probably eat you right yeah. now. <laughs> oh, I see him. He's a bear. Oh, oh my goodness. All right, so we're here at some point and we're doing a little hike down to Bering Falls. But the view along the trail is pretty good too. Ashton, what'd you find? A tree, green rock. You found green rock? Yep. All right, we made it to Bering Falls. It was 0.6 miles in. The girls did okay. It was definitely worth the hike. We're about to find out if the 0.6 out is gonna be as enjoyable, because they're getting tired. The girls didn't make it very far. We actually had to backtrack and go to the nearest scenic overlook on the highway, and they're waiting for me while I walk back to the truck and come pick them up. But I get to walk looking at this. We're still hiking. I don't know who measures these trails off but they padding the numbers a little bit because it's a lot longer than 0.6. Anyway, hope Ashlyn and Alicia and Kayla are doing all right because I'm still walking back to the truck. We finally made it to the truck. It's funny, everybody else was saying the same thing. Whoever's been measuring those trails is really off. Let's go pick up the girls. Hopefully they didn't get too bored waiting for me. Hey, y'all going somewhere? Hey, we need a ride. Are y'all lost? Can you take us somewhere? Maybe. Bye. We need a park. We got to see this. Okay. So I found the girls safe and sound. Thank God. And uh, they show me I have to uh, get out of the truck and come check out this tunnel right here. So uh, we're going to check out this tunnel. I think it's just a bridge, but Ashton likes to call it a tunnel. Service is one of the second customers of the day. <laughs> First, I found these girls, 
and then I found a group of hikers that needed a hike back to their car. So we're gonna give them a ride about five miles up the road back to their cars. It was funny. They said there wasn't a lot of prospects for hitchhiking in the area, but leave it to the Texas folk to have a truck. Ladies, marry a gentleman. They always do the right thing. So this guy right here has made poor choices. <laughs> Who is gonna bicycle up this? Pro tip, if there's no one on the road, you can actually drive in the middle. <laughs> Just like this. <laughs> Can you say Red Rock? This is Red, Red Rock. Rock. We're going to see the Red Rock? Yeah. Let's go see the Red Rock. for me <laughs> you literally just froze and worked for me that's funny we just got done checking out red rock and there was people jumping in the water more than one and they were walking yeah. very fast back to the car got back to the campground glacier national park was something else the going to the sun road awesome they say you shouldn't do it in a dually we did it anyway it was tight in places but totally doable parking spots a little hard to come by but if you do it just right you can get in and see everything you need to see it's definitely up there in the top two it's competing right there with yellowstone for the best place we've seen since we've been here so anyway we're here for nine more days so we're probably going to go back at least one more time if not two so there may be a part two could even be a part three. Glacier National Park is that awesome.